We actually have to come in. I mean, we can see if he's going to show up or not from the front door. Believe me, it's weird of me walking in here. At least you've got a faith. The nearest I've been to church on Christmas Day is lying on my sofa in my PJs, praying that the roses tin isn't full of empty wrappers. <laughs> At least not with you, is it? It's just the warden's trying to get hold of the deacon to start the service. Oh, we thought he might be here. Yeah, well, people are getting fidgety. They want to get the service done and the dinner on. See if you can get them singing, so everyone loves to sing so on Christmas. <laughs> well, that's that. If Billy was going to be anywhere on Christmas Day, we'll be here. Come on, let's go. This is no sign of the vicar. I'm appointing you as his representative on Earth. Excuse me? I want to know where my granddaughter is. It's Christmas together as a family. You're just the three of them. They probably don't want the grandmas interfering. Grandmas? I've known Summer since she was a tiny baby. I fought for her, feared for her, prayed for that child all her life. You were parachuted in on some PC Rainbow family ticket. We're not alike. Now, that's enough. Arlene loves that kid. We both do. Then where is she? She was meant to meet me. She didn't show up. And neither your son nor a man I've been informed is unfit to take care of her are answering their phones. Informed? Who informed you when? I just know. That's all. From who? A reliable source who I'm not prepared to name. Oh, when was this? Come on, I mean, if someone's interfering... Arlene. Look, she's lying. All she cares about is taking down Todd and Billy so she can have summer. Actually, it was someone related to your son's business partner. So I would say a reliable source. And I'm telling you now, I shall rescue my granddaughter from your family. She belongs with me. Someone related to Adam? Who? Why would the Barlows contact her? 